What's up, little babies? I am back with another video, and today we're gonna be talking about Wendy Williams and Sherry Shepard uh, comparisons. So we're gonna talk about the comparisons between the two. Um, and I actually been thinking about doing this video ever since Sherry Shepard has took Wendy Williams' place on the uh, network. So, but I just went to help myself. I said, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. Anyways, after me and my friend was like drinking and smoking the other night, we was talking. And actually, we was talking about the, st the lady at the liquor store. Her name's Sarah. I got her number and everything, y'all. Uh, he was talking about Sarah. He was like, Sarah is busty. I'm like, what the fuck you mean busty? What is busty? And basically, he was saying that her boobs are like big, super big. But I was looking at her today, walking around the corner. I'm like, damn, Sarah kind of thick, thick. She is kind of busty. So, I swear to God, y'all. I don't think I knew about busty when I was like looking at my baby daddy watching like porn stuff. Uh, my baby daddy, my second son. Yeah, so that's the only thing I knew about Busty. But I was, I'm like, what are you talking about? But I, I knew what he was talking about, but I just wanted to hear it from his mouth as a man. But he's still a gay man. But still, a man know what the fuck Busty is, obviously. Anyways, we're going to compare the replacement of Wendy Williams, which is Sherry Shepard. Now, the first thing I noticed is the upper body is very Busty. And their bottom body is, you know, voluptuous and it's curved the right way. It's not BBL curved. It's naturally curved, but you can tell there have been some type of boob job, but it's nothing to be ashamed of because, but honestly, a lot of people thought because Wendy Williams has been sick. It's because of the boobs and she, that she haven't got replaced because, you know, we've been seeing a lot of these reality stars as K. Michelle and many more Shekana and uh, more people that's Kiki Wyatt that's getting their um, booty back to normal and they're taking out all of these injections because it's sinking it's sinking to their lower um their upper thigh so they have to get them replaced or removed because and it's just better and they actually look better when they get them removed like you know um yeah it's crazy what vanity would do actually i've been thinking about getting work done but this is not that video uh neither here or there but let's get right into um this is kind of lengthy. I don't know if y'all going to listen to it or not. But I know y'all love Wendy Williams like I love Wendy Williams. So it's always good to talk about her, keep her uh, spirit alive. But it's just always good to keep people uh, name alive and their, you know, their hard work and their success. Just always be there to um, praise them when you can, you know, and just maybe they'll hear that and maybe they will, um, you know, maybe... You know, it, it'll it touch them in some type of way. Um, but let's get into the comparisons between the two. Um, as we can see, uh, Sherry is looking like a... Um, uh, I'm not going to say that. Like, I seen her video with... I was going to say, like, an off-brand of Wendy Williams. Like, let's just be real. Like, where Wendy Williams' name where it was is Sherry's name right now. Like... As a black woman, like when I was got when I got caught stealing crab legs in the store, who is it? Oh my God, what's up? Oh, you beat on the door for a color, a color picture, a color picture. What is this? A ghost? Yeah. Where? Where's the ghost? Go show you that. Where is this the cat? I'm recording a video, mommy. Let me pause the video. Hold on. Hold on. Y'all, I swear to God, it felt like my daughter just bust in here with a picture saying a ghost was in here. And she drew a picture of the ghost. And I walked out there and my body felt so weird. Like it was around some type of entity. And um, that's real life. That happened in real life right now. Uh, I'm back. Let me just wrap this up really quickly. Um... I have pictures. Let's put these pictures in here. I'm probably gonna put them in there before, but as you as you seen the pictures below, uh, I mean, as you seen the pictures in the beginning of the video, um, <clears throat> just do the comparison yourself. Just look at it. What do you think? Like, it looks like they got an off brand, great value, Wendy Williams. I'm just gonna keep it real, but it seems like when Wendy Williams 
were was when her um when her energy started to phase away and they couldn't drain her anymore because I go back and watch all of the Wendy Williams after shows like Wendy was all she was she was her she was being she was being paid for the person she were she was on and off the stage let's just clear it up right now Wendy Williams have paid the fucking way she worked for her shit and she's been doing this for a long time and I, I salute Wendy and I salute Sherry Shepard too you know but this is a yeah this is and I don't want to be like I don't I want to be very sensitive about the topic because I'm not here to bash anybody when I do my reaction videos I'm not here to bash anyone like come on now Let's be real. Like, I don't live my life to sit here and bash anyone or to sit here and just look uh, nitpick and shit. Like, I don't do that, bro. I was bullied back in the day. Like, I don't do shit like that. But comment below and let me know what you think about this video. Was Sherry Shepard an easy target? Was she? Like, was she, um... Was she so desperate that she was like, you know what? I'm going to take this reality show. I don't give a fuck if I'm taking another woman's, another black woman's spot. You know, I got to do what I got to do. I got to eat. I'm hungry, too. My son is hungry.